Hello guys and welcome back to the Match Day Vlogs. I'm Jordan and today I have a Match Day Vlog at home to Boybridge Heath. It's been a few weeks since my last Match Day Vlog. The form hasn't been great, but we did get a draw against Phoenix on Wednesday and hopefully we can carry that momentum into today's game. After our 6-0 defeat against Sittingbourne last Saturday, it was good to get the point against Phoenix. Hopefully we can get another three points on the board today and start building our season from here. Come with me and I'll take you to the ground and to see the boys. Which is looking pretty decent today. Looks quite nice. Bit of water on the grass and also cut as well, so decent. They're quite any. All right, boys. So guys, just a little bit about what I was getting done there with the acupuncture on my knee. Um, I've been struggling with my knee for a little while now, uh, for about three or four years really since I left Wigan. It's one of them where I've got a fit of, I think it's uh, patella ten, patella femoral pain syndrome or a bit of t uh, patella tendonitis. So I've been struggling with that a little bit, um, just sort of loosening off the IT band. Um, so not so much pain through my knee really. Um, and also I've got a bit of a wrist strapping on today, as you can see. Don't normally wear wrist strappings, but um, it's one of them where I got a bit of a, a bad landing on it on Wednesday. And it's been causing me pain pretty much at work and everything like that. So just a bit of a precaution really, keep my sort of uh, wrist in position. So it's not really moving too much throughout the game. So yeah, it's a little bit about that. So I'm gonna bring you out in the warm up today as well. I was about to go and get ready now and get changed. So yeah, see you in the warm up. Come on! 
warm up done. Pretty good. All well, finished. Here we go now. Get ready for the game. See you in the game, guys. So guys, it is now a week later after our 2-1 defeat to Broadbridge Heath. Uh, yeah, thoughts about the game. Obviously, we weren't the best in terms of making things clinical in front of goal. Not enough goals coming from up top, but then also we, it's individual mistakes from ourselves. Unfortunately, yeah, uh, my centre-half, Rob Strachan, who's normally an unbelievable player. It's one of them days for him, really. Um, obviously, the ball comes back to him and he's a sort of a lapse of concentration, really. But... To be fair, he's been brilliant all season so far and he'll bounce back from this. Um, since then, we've also had our game against Ramsgate, which we lost 4-1 to in the week in the league. Obviously, they come out of a really good win against Totten in the FA Cup for preliminary rounds, which are now into the first round proper. It's a fantastic achievement for them. Um, obviously, they were on a high. They took their chances on Tuesday night. Um, and yeah, it's one of them where we've got to kind of move on. Um, but now today, another sort of hurdle 
is our game was called off against Seven Oaks in the league. So it's now even longer until we have to try and bounce back from that. So yeah, not an ideal situation. But it's one of them where we've got a London Cup game in, in midweek coming up um, against Fisher, which will be another difficult test. Um, someone I reckon who will get cause problems. We are at home. So obviously we've got up advantage in terms of playing at home, but at the end of the day, we'll bounce back from this and also try and get uh, a rhythm going now in the league um, to get as many points as we can. So yeah, disappointing time at the moment, but all we can do is keep positive, keep plugging away, keep working hard on the training pitch and um, yeah, just put it aside and move on. So I've also started my own little goalkeeping academy. It's very small at the moment, only working with a few sort of lads. Um, that I know locally, uh, that I've also coached one of them as well. Uh, he's a brilliant young young lad, um, really enjoy working with him. I work with him, obviously, with the team I coach on a Sunday and Saturday morning, AFC Minster. Uh, big shout out to them. Uh, started my coaching journey through that, really. Helping out on the sideline, obviously, warming Albie up. Um, and also had a goalkeeper, Miles, last year. He was a good goalkeeper. He's now gone to Sheffield United, doing really well for himself. Um, yeah. So really at the moment it's sort of progressing, trying to get more people coming to the group sessions and also one-to-one -one sessions. Um, yeah, so really exciting times for myself and obviously just got to keep building um, and hopefully try and share a bit of my knowledge to uh, anyone really, any goalkeeper at any level. So uh, yeah, looking forward to it and yeah, it'll be a very exciting time for pairing goalkeeping. So guys, thank you very much for watching this match day vlog. Unfortunately, due to the, um, the GoPro and the goal, it doesn't sit too well in my goal at the Wellings ground. So what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to get an attachment that can either sit on, on the net in the goal, also maybe like a spike that can sit in the ground, so it sits a bit higher. But obviously because there's a slight slope at Wellings ground, it's a bit hard for sort of the level of where the GoPro sits. So the footage I looked back at from Broadbridge Heath wasn't the best. And obviously I'm only trying to give you the best content possible. So thanks to uh, Ian from Belvedere for letting me use the match day highlights from the game. Um, yeah, so that's what I've put in there this week uh, for your entertainment. Also change it up a little bit because obviously if you see the GoPro and the goal all the time, sometimes it could be get a little bit boring for you viewers, guys. Um, but yeah, so sort of changing it up a little bit. I'm try trying to also get some footage from the outsides in, um, maybe from the sideline, maybe from the corner, just sort of angles that obviously you guys might not see uh, when you come to watch a game or you see on TV. So yeah, but no, I appreciate the support, guys. And if you don't mind, please go and subscribe to my channel, Pairing Goalkeeping. Um, please share my goalkeeping coaching academy um, on your social medias. Really appreciate the support, guys. But yeah, take care and I'll see you in the next vlog.